A list of names that are not mine. Pallavi, Pillavi, Paliva, or Paula Dean. <laughs> Cheeto, Frito, Dorito, or literally any other snack food. It's not okay for you to call me Tito. Paula. Because that's easier for you to pronounce. My name is... Paula B. Otito. Most people don't know my first name means the new leaves on trees that grow in the springtime. I was born in the middle of May to parents who wanted a girl, who wanted to turn over a new leaf. Most people don't know that my full first name is 15 letters and seven syllables long. It means praise be to God. It means my mother thanked God for putting a breathing being in her arms after her womb wept at the death of six unborn babies. My last name is Gregory. Or Parker. My last name is Hyphening. The first part is Greg, which is just my father's middle name. Back then, he never thought he'd have a son to call Greg, so he just made a part of my last name. The second part is OB, which means heart. I like to think this roughly translates to my father's heart. My last name is Wakarker, which means my ancestors were miners. In its harsh three syllables, I can almost hear the clanging of iron and coal. Every time I spell it out to people, I am reminded of this hard labor. Mispronouncing my name is not just a microaggression, it is violence. It is erasing my identity and the miscarriages that came before me. It tells me, you don't belong here. Your name doesn't fit in my mouth. Your body doesn't fit in my country. Stop trying to make my name more comfortable for you. I don't exist for your comfort. My parents did not immigrate across an ocean so I could mispronounce my own name. So it fits better in your mouth. My name. My name is my mother's first gift to me. She saw the beauty in the world and named me after it. Stop taking that away. I am not a lozenge to soothe your tongue or a neck brace for your threatened throat. So say my name. Say that. Make your mouth a vessel and return me to the soil you stole me from. Say my name. And respect my mother's tongue. Our names are long. They take up space in your mouth on standardized tests, on diplomas, on the page. We don't need your whitewashed nicknames. We, we refuse to shorten. We refuse to shrink. When meeting new people, when starting our careers, in line at Starbucks, on, on the, the first, first day of class, class, every time a teacher does roll call, I flinch. I feel myself start to apologize for the difficulty my name poses. Hi, y'all. My name is Susan. Uh, I'll be your substitute teacher for today. So let's get started with some attendance, OK? Uh, Bob. Here. <laughs> Becky. Here. Ooh, uh, this one's a doozy. Sorry if I mispronounce it. Uh, pal, pal. No worries, that's me. I do this to put her out of her suffering, but, but my, my name, name is not, not suffering. suffering. My name is a budding leaf. A new start. My name is praise to God. My mother's name means God's will. My father's name means God's strength. In my culture, we don't just have baptisms, we have naming ceremonies. We are not just leaves on the family tree, we are pages in scripture. When you're born, your parents name you after a moment in your family's history, even as the ink is still drying. If your father's mother dies at the time of your birth, there's a name for that. If your uncle was fighting in the Biafran War at the time of your birth, there's a name for that. Even while you are pink and new and testing out your lungs for the first time, your parents are trusting you to tell these stories just by introducing yourself. In my culture, names are ancient. Like the songs we sang to bronze gods I don't recognize. Ancient. Like, well... The, the patriarchy. patriarchy. My mother's name <laughs> means the deepest truth, and my father's name means victory. I, I come, come from meaning. meaning. Everything, Everything has, has meaning. meaning. Our names are not just a series of sounds you choose to not say. We are symbols of what our parents wish to add to the world. I am the creation of the deepest truth and the happiest victory. So, so I, I need, need you to say my name. My name is Palavi Wakarkar. My name is Otito Dilichuku Gregobi. So say my name. <laughs> 